we're answering your questions on tips on how to soul win. Now, what happens if you come across somebody that's um, inebriated, drunk, or high, or just under the influence? What do you do? You do the same thing that you've been doing. Show them grace. You're there to give them a message. It doesn't matter how they receive it. You're there to plant a seed and give the message, regardless of what they're doing. Because grace covers you just as it covers them. Exactly. Um, if you're out doing your soul winning, if you be you in the parking lot, be you, you know, you know, up on the area in a public area, and you walk up to someone who is rolling up a joint, uh, uh, um, like this, right? I mean, this is not a joint, but you know, this will make the joint but for purposes of, 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 of demonstration. Let them draw that last one. And brother, sister, when they draw that last one, you minister Christ to them. The That's same right. way you would do as though you walked up to the regular person. Because I tell you this, at that point, they need Christ more than anyone else. And at that point, they're much more willing and open to have an honest dialogue about some things concerning their life. And when they see that you're not out to judge them, they are going to open up to you. And you'll be surprised what the Lord will do in the most uncommon places. Keep those comments and reactions coming. We'll see you soon.